Hey guys, it's Chozy. Welcome to my channel. So in this video, I wanted to answer some questions about psychic attacks. Now, what is the difference, say, between someone sending you negative energy or a psychic attack? Psychic attack has a little bit more intention behind it. Somebody deliberately <laughs> sending you negative energy. So this is what you're feeling and you know who it is or you may not even know who it is but you feel like somebody's sending you negative energy what to do how to reverse this situation so i wanted to give you some guidance number one release the fear this is a very difficult thing to do but you need to do it i don't care how <laughs> go into meditation go out for a walk release the fear because fear is like glue. It picks up all of the negative thoughts to it. It's like attracting all of these thoughts to come to you. So you will see more of these negative thoughts. You'll have more and more fear. Fear will grow. You will now live, you will vibrate. Your energy will be vibrating in the level of fear. Just find a way to release fear. Breathe in and out. Now you're in control. You are in control. You are the highest form of divine intelligence on earth. Nothing can be done to you, you know, unless you consent to it. So be sure that you have the power and confidence and control. Nobody can do anything to you. So release the fear. Stop worrying. You are okay. You will be okay. So the key here is to keep that neutral vibration not to dive into feelings of anxiety and fear. So the second way to deal with psychic attacks is to do clearing and grounding meditations. You can go on YouTube, just chakra clear meditation or grounding meditations. I have some on my website as well. They're free. You can, you can use them. They're just like energy shower. You're clearing your energy through these practices. Go out in nature. Nature will help you to release all these negative emotions, even though you may be accumulating somebody's thought forms, somebody's energy in you when you go outside. Just breathe, just let this energy run through you, you know, connect with the earth. Earth will pull all these emotions out of your system. It will be clearing. So nobody else has any power over you. You are powerful. So have this energy flow to you. When you are afraid, when you're anxious, when you're worried, the energy goes all over the place. So you need to be centered. You need to be strong like a tree, right? It's so a stronger roots. It doesn't matter what happens like a palm tree, you know, strong winds, but you are, you know, your ground, you stay strong. So practicing grounding meditations, clearing meditations, chakra meditations, working with your energy centers will put you back into alignment. And this is the true power. This is true strength that you have in you as an energy being. So number three, if you feel like somebody's energy is really sticky on you, right? So what you can do, you can take a bath with salt, with sea salt, Epsom salts. So because salt is a very, very clearing, well, minerals, crystal. So it will help you to get rid of all of the negative energy really quickly. So fill your bath with some sea salts, maybe put some essential oils, a nice candle, some nice music and relax. That salt will take care of all of the negativity and you will feel much cleaner. So you will release all of the negative bonds. So no fear. Do the chakra clearing and grounding. Take bath with salt. Clear, let the water clear. Water clears everything. Add some salt to it. It's just really magical potion. Finally, now this is a powerful one. So powerful. You guys need to understand whenever someone is sending you negative vibration. So you need to neutralize that energy. Not to receive it. Not to aggressively send and more negative vibes their way because you just create this cycle of negative thoughts. So break that cycle by sending that person blessing. Now it's a hard thing to do. How can I bless someone who's cursing me? Well, do you want this energy to stop this nightmare to stop bothering you? So please understand that sending somebody's blessing is your way to neutralize the energy. So it's a positive force, it's a negative force. So you bring this together so they just neutralize each other and 
you will not be affected. So bless. And that's why people, you know, Jesus said, bless everybody, you know. <laughs> bless your enemies. Because for this, this reason, that it will not affect you, you will be safe, you will be protected. So bless. Send them the blessing. Smile. Fill your heart with love. And then send the blessing to whoever is sending you negative vibrations. And you will not be affected. So here go, my friends, some thoughts, some practical tips on how to deal with psychic attacks. I hope this video helped. If you want to share your stories, please put them in the comment section below. And no fear. Remember, no fear. Thank you so much for watching. I'll chat with you in the next video.